Not so. Not even Rain has affected that exactly. Joe Reed, tough to handle and down hard. Indiana, Indiana. Look at what the Hoosiers have done. A takeaway turnover. Perkins. The gap is closing. Oh, Micah McFadden. Make him plays. Obviously. And they know they were thinking that, so they put it on the ground to Sanders. And it's McFadden who comes over to make the stop. Welcome to the ball game. It's something that's a new wrinkle for Michigan, and it's been a real problem for opposing defense. First down and 10 of the 48-yard line. Patterson running it again. And then Patterson will be taken down behind the line of scrimmage. Michael McFadden. Down and eight at midfield for Michigan. Patterson with time. Dumps it off. Higdon, but he will not get the first down because Michael McFadden, the freshman. Time dwindling in the opening half. The Reese's Peanut Butter Cups halftime report soon to come your way. Was the head coach for the Hoosiers in that Holiday Bowl win in San Diego back in 79. Hard hit delivered to Brantley as he's wrapped up and finished off by Micah McFadden. He was. The first option is the wide receiver on a corner route. If it's not there, throw it backside. But unfortunately, this time for the Spartans, that goes backwards. On his lower leg. And they go to Collins, and Collins is swarmed in the backfield. Micah McFadden leading the charge, the linebacker for Indiana. Pacheco gets the start in the backfield. Somehow this Rutgers offense has to hit the reset button. And going nowhere, the first to get to it. D.K. Bonham, Michael McFadden. Bring pressure. And here it comes. Langan gets away from it. Finds Paul Woods, but well short. Michael McFadden. A big emphasis from Mike Loxley and Scotty Montgomery. Get it in third and manageable. With Leak back in, he runs it toward the 50. Very close. Happy to have him back out there. He was a game-time decision. And again, they're missing Maurice Washington, their normal starting running back. No carry or no gain on the carry that time for Wandale Roberts. I can see how they would call that. Yeah, it, it, this is third and forever. Wow. McFadden got in there and he dropped him. Micah McFadden with the sack, his first of the year for Indiana. Left side, he goes right through. That's just a blown assignment on that right side. They take the field for the first time. Here comes a blitz. It's a screen and it's very well played by Indiana. Lead you to believe it's a screen coming. McFadden is not fooled, kind of in man coverage right there on the tight end, ready for it. Big third down play right here for his defense. Coach Allen is a hard guy not to like. It's clear the players like him a lot. True Wilson, big stop by that defense, and now Jim Harbaugh has the decision on fourth down. And Alabama today, too, coming out there in the golf cart. Mm -hmm. Patterson under duress, throws an interception. Micah McFadden picks it off and brings it back outside the 15-yard line. To get away from the blitz, didn't get enough on the football, and Micah McFadden undercuts the route and gets the turnover for the Hoosiers. They've been in this position before. They have to finish this drive with six. I'll try Horvath again, and he is squeezed right at the nine. Orbach trying to spin his way forward. I don't think he'll be stopped. It's fourth down. And for the Boilermakers. Garantano's got an alley. And he gets flipped at the three. Third down two. Can Kane Womack's defense come up with a third down stop? They're coming with pressure up the middle. And it is intercepted. Michael McFadden with the pick, his second of the season. You see, here comes Cam Jones basically you know, almost meets the ball at the quarterback, and sometimes you just have to, to eat the football. Garantano tries to get it off, arm is hit, and Micah McFadden. Complete, but nothing. A loss of one. Nowhere for Ford. Michael McFadden right there. 
The last three drives, a couple of punts and interception. Bickford stepping up. Still looking down the field. And dropped down behind the line of scrimmage. Slip it out to Devin Ford. And he is brought down right away by Micah McFadden. Both doing their deal. Watch him here, and you'll see 31 Fitzgerald forcing it from the outside and squeeze right there and get Devin Ford on the ground. Say that again. Squeeze. <laughs> Three wides to the near side. Federal sprints that direction. Running out of real straight pass is picked off. A sliding defensive effort right on the sideline. And so you see he's going to stay in the background, and all he's going to do is roll out. And he undercuts us right at the end and makes the pick. Bedrill, that's a poor decision by Bedrill. He threw the ball behind the receiver as well. A Rutgers team that was so... Third down and 10. Quarterback trying to take off, but nowhere to go is Micah McFadden, team captain on defense, sacks Peyton Thorne. If I know Coach Izzo, he is watching this game because he's a hardcore football fan. I have stood on many a cold sideline right next to Tom Izzo. <laughs> Thorn in trouble and sacked by 15 Hoosiers back at the five-yard line, so they'll have to punt. In order to create those one-on-one -on -one shots downfield that they will thrive on in the weeks to come. Thorn in trouble and sacked back at the 11-yard line by McFadden. Second down and nine. Master T back in the game, and he's tackled for a loss by Micah McFadden. Talia Tunga Bailoa just three for his last ten passing attempts after a loss of eight across the middle, and this one's going to be intercepted. Micah McFadden, the third pick of the game for Talia Tunga Bailoa. And IU in business on the strength of this defense. It was the pressure physical pressure before but now it's drop eight drop a lot of clutter including McFadden who does nothing more than look back at the quarterback and continue to get depth over any route that is crossing the middle and that's perfection right there by Mike McFadden you know, Tom Allen's blueprint for what he's done at Indiana, he started actually 25 years ago as a high school coach in Florida. He took over a fledgling Christian high school and had not won more than three games in two decades. When he took over, he said, we're going to start out by building trust and relationships among the players and coaches. So really important to be good on first and second down. Second and eight. Not much there at all for Berger as he is dragged down by Micah McFadden has been a terrific player for Wisconsin. We're here to honor these kids for you guys. Wayne and Jill, we're thinking of Garrett. Isn't that great stuff there as Graham Martz is taken down by Micah McFadden. Right now their defense needs to prove it. Or does Mertz have some magic in him? Taken down and taken down hard, and it was McFadden. Kelly, the motion man. Pump fake, pressure, and Corral. Barely escapes it, but goes down behind the line of scrimmage. And a sack for Indiana, Jerome Johnson. Leaders at their positions for the Rebels this season. Very slow developing play and nowhere to go for Snoop Connor. And is built to play linebacker. It was a great play to get through here. The field. It's a big third down. Yeah, it is big. Third down at four. Wildcat, Goodson. And he's not going to get there. Spencer Petrus, the junior from California, drops it underneath. Goodson tackled quickly. First carry of the game for Gavin Williams. The running back is Roshan Johnson, and Johnson lowers his shoulder over the 30, but stopped at the 31, four yards short. Raheem Lane and McFadden double up. Really well done. That's that's good stuff by that O-line. Idaho's first drive went six yards. This one starts with a negative play. Mike Beaudry at quarterback for Idaho to start the game. This is his second series and their second series. And he's in the pocket and he wants to throw. And the ball is out. And the Hoosiers have jumped on it.
Here comes the pressure. And McFadden and Anderson are there. Indiana recovers. So five pre-snap penalties on Cincinnati. Four false starts. Ritter to the air. Pressure backside. The ball is out. He gets sacked. And then the offensive lineman tried to pick it up with one hand. McFadden scoops it up for the Hoosiers. It'll be Indiana ball inside the 10. Ryder Anderson has already become a leader of this football team, and he's working on a redshirt freshman, making only his third start. And this is a highly experienced guy. You see the hands, the rip gets up. Then just get the sack, gets the ball out with the big hit on Desmond Ritter, and then a mistake also by the redshirt freshman. John Williams, you jump on that ball. Okay. You don't pick it up with one hand. Chase McSorley and Michael Robinson ahead of them, and well ahead of them, both with more than 1,600 rushing yards. Love it. Nice play by Michael McFadden. He runs so well. He takes a good angle. He makes plays sideline to sideline. He's an excellent blitzer. 103 yards rushing so far for the Nittany Lions. Clifford is taken down for a loss. Well, here he is right here. Now, he's supposed to be blocked. This is a design quarterback draw where the lead back is the blocker. And McFadden just destroyed Kayvon Lee. He just ran right through him and tackled Sean Clifford. And moving well. Allen said they absolutely need him to play. And his message amidst all these defensive injuries is don't blink and keep battling. Clifford under center, gave it to Lee, and he gets stacked up. Wow. Penn State trying to get big. Three tight ends in the game. Just excellent technique, fighting off the block, and getting in there by Cam Jones to make this play. Number four, right at the point of attack. McFadden there to help. It's the progressive pylon replay. You can see clearly great goal line stand by the Indiana Hoosiers. That was the 68th play. Third and one. Oh, stopped by McFadden. Who needs two good thumbs? What a stop by the Hoosiers. Team to slow down this run game and watch McFadden. There is no hesitation. He knows what's coming. He's unblocked. That's miscommunication up front. There is no way that a game plan does not have 47 circled. Thorne pressure. Thorne brought down by the five. Micah McFadden and Ryan Anderson. Tying coverage with that pressure up front. A good little cushion to the speedy receivers. You stay on top. Thorne can't push the ball down the field. And then it's the guys up front, and McFadden did it in the run game. That time he beats the left guard, Duplain. Complete to Trey Mosley. Mosley's first catch of the day. Raheem Lane, Devon Matthews on the tackle. Fourth down now. Throwing all kinds of time. Scanning. Rolling. McFadden brings him down. Micah McFadden. Some more defense. Does this kid have the heart of a lion or what? Surgery last week, broken thumb. You can see the cast, and he's not going to get juked or faked by that pump. Sometimes Don't know how long we'll see him. He's in trouble here on first down, though, and sacked by Micah McFadden. Well, this is a guy who's not going to quit the entire night. The heart and soul of this team, the heart and soul of this defense, he's really good. Coming off the edge, times up his blitzes perfectly, runs right past Paris Johnson, and gets himself. I think I think I'm right with the, the timeline of this. If Mike Vrabel was on that Ohio State staff, Ryan Day, Luke Fickle, they're, they're all head coaches. Went on forever. Ten and Peyton. Marvin Harrison from Philadelphia. As uh, Micah McFadden still playing hard, takes down Pryor. Football is the way it's meant to be played. Gives you everything he's got on the field. Set his feet and throw, and he's as good as anybody. Here's a third and long. Pressure up the middle, and Micah McFadden gets to the quarterback. Pass rusher is, is your middle linebacker. And they know that, and so they bring him a lot of times. And this time McFadden comes clean and makes that. So he, he was in on a stunt, right? That wasn't even his job. His job was to take two guys, which he did. 
All right, through three for six through the air. They look to throw it here. He's sacked, and guess who? Micah McFadden. Between two powerful fellas right here, and he splits them. Sheesh. <laughs> That looked like the old days of his two-point takedown shooting on the wrestling mat. Ball in the red zone, first and ten. Irving dropped by Micah McFadden, no gain, second down. Here comes a blitz, Micah McFadden. And he helps plug the middle. Indiana's ready for the screen or the draw. Third and 18, Indiana brings three. Pass caught by Horvath. He is tackled by Micah McFadden at the 41.